Okay, so I've been working on creating bar codes and stuff like that and saving and screen dumping and all pretty much all day. And I noticed that, let me see, this up here went from autosave to unable to autosave. Now, why would that happen? So, so um, when you go back, let me go back here. Really can't show you too much. So when you go back to file, there's going to be, at the bottom, there's going to be an option box when you see all your files on your on drive, okay? And it's also showing your local drive. You go down the bottom, you'll say, it'll say file, print, save, and all the way down, it'll say options. Click on options. Options will give you this. Uh, so you get this. This will appear. You want to click on save. You want to make sure. Uh, you may want to change some settings here. I added this setting here. Say by default, save the computer because if it can't save to the on drive, what's going to happen? And you know why it's not saving to the on drive? So you're doing screen dumps. So it's saving all the screen dumps. So you can have, you might max out your um, you know, whatever you got, uh, one terabyte, two terabyte, whatever you're paying with them. You know, you can max that out. So you got to go in there. It's on your local drive, right? And you're going to highlight all the screen dumps and, you know, what you don't want. Delete them all. You don't need them. You want to keep what you want. So you got to do that. Or tell this program to go in there. That's what happens when you scroll down to the bottom of this. You get this. I right, check this. Delete your catches. Because when you delete the catches, it's much faster for viewing. Otherwise, take a long time. I never bother with it. That's what you should do. And that will solve your problem. Well, this is what I would recommend doing. You do all of this. Save it all to your hard drive. Okay? And they can have two copies now. One, in the, one on the on drive and one on the local drive. Eventually, it'll, it'll sort itself out. But you're going to have to run this program. And you're going to have to clear out everything because you've been doing a lot of clipboard. Right? Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And you'll have to clean out the clipboard. Okay, you don't have to run the full wise program. You can do that another time. But you're going to be, you know, using the clipboard. Or say you're using the clipboard for several hours, right? You're going to have some weird stuff happen. Like, for instance, 